The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, first canto, third chapter, text number one, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on November 14th, 1972, in Vrindavan, India. Hmm. Amhutam Sura Sakalam आदो लोगों से शिक्षाया तो आदो इन द बिगिनिंग द लोगों से शिक्षाया और क्रिएटिंग द कास्मलाजी जब भी है पौरुषन रूपों पर्सन द क्रिएशन इस समय फ्रॉम द पर्सन एंड नॉट from uh, impersonal. The modern scientists, uh, their theory of creation, there are something matter, junk or something like that. What do they say? What is the beginning of creation? But here, we find it quite reasonable because everything is from the person, jagrihe paurusamri, rupam, form. It is not from imperson, jagrihe paurusam rupam. So we don't theorize, we accept the statement of the Vedas, that is our process of knowledge, defending process. We take knowledge from the authority. Of course, the scientists also say they take from authority, but originally, as explained by our Ayur <coughs> Prabhu, uh, it does not appear that the knowledge was taken from authority, the theory. Theory, one can put theory of his own, and there are so many theories, uh, but we don't accept theories. We want solid facts. The solid fact is, uh, <coughs> The Lord created. In the Bible also, it is said, the God said that there is creation. It is from the person. Here also, we find the creation begins from the person. Uh, uh, <coughs> In the Vedas, it is said, sa oikhata Sa-asrijata, by the glance, he looked over, God looked over, and he created the references to the person. We also find from our experience that whenever there is something manufacturing or creation, we do not find automatically some matter uh, uh, comes into being. We don't, we, we, we have such experience. Whenever there is anything manufactured or created, there is a person behind it. <coughs> so, uh, this is not a very good theory that from the junk or some matter exploded and immediately the universe came into existence. And that is not a very good theory. But this is nice. Jagdhi Paurasam Rupa. This Paurasam, the Mahavishnu, Garbhodakshai Vishnu, and Hirodakshai Vishnu, they are expansion of Krishna. Advaita Achyuti Anadi Anantarupam. 
he incarnates, he expands himself in various incarnations. Now, for the creation, these three uh, persons, all as persons, Garmodukhai Vishnu person, Kirodukhai Vishnu person, and uh, Karanar Navajal, Karanar Navashai Vishnu person, and Karunana is a Vishnu, Mahavishnu, he is also expansion of Sankarsa. And Sankarsa is expansion of Baladev. Baladev is expansion of Krishna. <coughs> uh, therefore, Krishna becomes the origin. Ishara Parama Krishna Satyananda Vigraha Anadi. Uh, he has no beginning. But he is beginning. Anadi Adi. He, is a, he has no beginning, but he is the beginning of creation. Anadi Adi Govinda Sarva Karana Karana. <coughs> so, Mahatatsa, the total material energy, and six, uh, five elements, Sixteen, sixteen, Saurasakala. Uh, what are those? The five elements, uh, namely, uh, earth, water, fire, air, and uh, sense objects and senses, and uh, the spirit soul in this way, sixteen, and from sixteen it expands to twenty-four. Uh, that is the explanation of our very creation. Sura Sakala. Yasaika nishasita kalama thavalamma jivanti loma bilaja jagadandana tha vishnu mahan saiha jasakala vishwiso govindamadi purisam tamahamana. Mahavishnu, from the skin hole of Mahavishnu, the uh, small particles of universes are coming into being. Uh, <coughs> everything, the nature's way, it comes a very small particle, then it grows. Anything is said. It's like our body. The small particle, the soul, it is measured as one ten thousand part of the tip of the hair, when it is placed in the omb of the uh, oval uh, by the man, uh, then the body grows. Uh, that is the seed. Ahanga Bija Pada Pita, Krishna says, that I am the seed giving father. That's uh, like, uh, yes, we practically see the male semina is injected uh, within the womb of the female, and because the living entity, very small, one ten thousand part of the people is there, because that living entity is there, the body grows. Uh, unless the living entity is there, there will be no pregnancy. No. As soon as the living entity is there, the body grows, and that is known as pregnancy. Daily grows. The mother can understand it is growing. Similarly, without the spirit soul entering into the matter, there is no possibility of creation. In the Bhagavad Gita, also it is said, Vishtabhya aham ekamsena <coughs> Because I have entered into this universe by my plenary portion, therefore it is exist. It is explained in the Bhagavad Gita. So without spiritual task there is no question of matter. Uh, working or expanding or growing, there is not possible. So, in the seed of any tree, 
because there is that living entity that which goes into a big tree. Every tree, they are also living entity in a different form. So, <coughs> here also in the creation, without the supreme living entity entering within the Mahatattva, there is no possibility of creation. We can <coughs> very easily understand by the example of our own body. Uh, this body, as we spiritual enter into this body, the existence of body uh, continues. Janma dasya jataha. So, the body is not created uh, first. Okay? Because the living entity enters into the body, therefore the body is created. Similarly, this gigantic body, universal body, cannot come into existence automatically. That is not a very good theory. How? There is no such example. Uh, Unless the living entity is there, this body, we get this experience, it does not grow. If a child is born, dead, the body does not grow. Therefore, it is to be concluded, there is something, even if we do not accept the spirit soul, there must be something, uh, on account of the presence of that something, the body is going. Similarly, take this gigantic body of the universe, unless there is something like that as we are in this body, how this gigantic universe can go? This is common reason. We do not find that a <coughs> matter is growing automatically. No. A tree, a tree is growing, daily growing, new leaves, new twigs, new flowers, uh, because that living entity is within the tree. You cut the tree and throw it aside, there will be no more growing, it will dry. It will dry. Therefore the conclusion is, as it is said here, that jagrihe paurusam rupam, it is the Supreme Personality of Godhead, he after entering into the matter, there is possibility of creation. Otherwise there is no possibility of creation. Now, <coughs> this creation, is, because it is material creation, it does not exist uh, forever. It is come into existence and again it will be finished, annihilated. Exactly like our body. <clears throat> As this body, we have got uh, this body and certain dead, and it has got to be annihilated at a certain death. Similarly, this gigantic cosmology, material manifestation, it has a death of creation, and it, it stays for some time. Everything material, there are six changes. First of all, birth, uh, then staying for some time, then growing, uh, then producing some byproducts, and then dwindling, and then finish. Exactly like our body. Just like this body is born at a certain date, then it grows, it stays, it produces some byproduct. From this body, many children come out by-product. <coughs> then it becomes old, declining, and then one day finish. This is called sarovika, six changes. Six changes. Thank you.